I'm a way. I'm a way. Way. All right, guys. So, like the title says, we're gonna be changing the goddamn LEDs. Uh, so we're actually gonna change. Um, as you can see here, we have two lights, right? So we have, I don't know which side this is, but we have our low beams and we got parking lights. And currently we got uh, the, you know, stock halogen ugly ass lights. So we're gonna switch those to LEDs. I'm gonna be changing that to uh, stark phantom LED headlights. And then I just got these um, parking LED lights from Amazon. I'll be uh, putting all the links in the description for those that want to get this. So we're going to start from this left side. Obviously, first thing to do is remove your cap. Look at that. Made in Slovakia. Okay, so these caps actually come with a rubber piece as well. So make sure that sticks in there and that you keep it uh, intact. I believe we're going to have to drill some holes because uh, our LEDs have that big fan at the end. So it's not going to fit. Uh, I'll show uh, I'll show you guys that in a bit. Okay, so there you go. The cap is off. All right. So now you have your uh, your halogen uh, plug right there. So what you want to do is remove that. Okay. So that's good. Put it aside for now. Okay. And then you got these uh, two uh, thingies here. So you want to remove the first one on the left, and then the second one right okay so you want to hold this Jeez. okay and then you just want to twist it on either side until it actually goes off there's a like a sort of hook on the top here so you might have to move it clockwise or counterclockwise or just pull it and there you go so this is your ugly halogen Phillips light so that's gone and then your parking light your parking light is actually right here where my finger is right now that is where your parking light is so this one is really really easy all you got to do is pull it so you got to grab those uh, wires there and just kind of pull and it kind of comes out so this is your parking light so you know what the parking light is actually the easiest one to change. So we'll do this one first. So if I turn on the ignition, you're gonna see the parking light go on. Okay, so this is what it looks like before. Okay, so I'm gonna turn it off now. Okay, so this is my LED parking light. So this one is fairly easy. You just plug and play. Uh, Bear in mind that if you plug it in the wrong way, it's not going to work. So uh, before putting it back in, just turn your ignition back on again. And there you go. So this is your after. This is what it looks like once switched to LEDs. It's very bright and it's very nice compared to the uh, before. So I'm going to turn this off. And all you got to do now is uh, put it in. Pull it and push. Perfect. Let's show them how it looks like with it uh, there, with the parking light. Like there, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna turn it on. Yeah. Oh! oh! It actually looks so different. It looks like more blue because it's so yellow. Get, get a close up. Like that. Yeah. So that is your LED from after and then after on the other side, which is disgusting. And then over like backwards like, wow quite a difference okay so this is uh led bulbs the the stark phantom as i showed you in the beginning of the video uh it's uh, fairly easy as well so there's a plastic piece right here that you're gonna have to unmount out so this piece actually goes inside first remember that hook i was talking about that goes at the top so this hook will go up there and then we're gonna put the LED in and then we're gonna we're gonna plug this in and that plug that we took off. Yeah, so you guys can see the hook at the top. Uh, I don't know if y'all can see it, but I see it. So like I said, the plastic piece is gonna go in first. Okay, so this is good. And then we're gonna just lock it. 
my hands. Okay, so now the plastic piece is inside. So this is good. Okay, so now the LED goes in. Okay, and just try to find the, find the sweet spot. There you go, and then lock it. So now it is locked. It is good. So now you see how the fan actually, you know, steps out. So we're gonna have to drill holes uh, to make it fit. So I guess uh, your wiring, just try to kind of shove it in a bit inside to finally plug in your plug. Okay, so now that's plugged in. Now, the tough part is to actually uh, find a spot for this. I might have to unplug it and find another sweet spot because uh, this one's clearly not too good. Maybe I'll try to put this inside here. Yeah. Okay, so now it's plugged. Okay, I think this is the best we can do. All right, so uh, should we uh, should we show them how it looks like now? Mm -hmm. All right, so three, two, one. Okay guys, so uh, as you saw my fail, uh, if it doesn't work, it's the same concept as the parking light. So yeah, like I said, if uh, it's the same concept. So if it ever doesn't work, so at first I had it like this and it didn't work. So what you wanna do is you just wanna switch them, right? So if it was like this, switch it. And we'll test it one more time to make sure that it, it does work. Okay, start it again. This is good! Okay, so now we know it's working perfectly, so we're gonna try our best to uh, find a good placement for these. I think this is good. Okay, and then we're gonna try to put our calf back on. Okay, so again, like I said, make sure your rubber piece is there still. Okay, and then, oh, this is gonna be a mission. So you can see that right now, I cannot, I can't push further. And that's because of the fan. Okay, so we're actually gonna go drill holes right now and we will be back. All right guys, so uh, this is the uh, aftermath uh, after drilling uh, some, uh, some holes in this, uh, made in uh, Slovakia. But well, now, let's uh, get back in business. Okay, uh, all right, so uh, find your sweet spot and lock it in. There you go. Perfect, no gaps, perfect fitment. It's not gonna go anywhere and it's good enough for Megan. Uh, <laughs> all right, so that's the left side done. That's your high beam done. So left side, parking lights, LEDs, and high beams to LEDs. So we're gonna do the right side now. We are at the right side now, which is our low beam. Same thing again. It's the same process as the left side. You know, our uh, famous cap made in Slovakia. Uh, same thing again, just remove the plug. Okay, so once the plug is removed, move that out of the way, and then move those uh, I guess they're called fasteners or whatever they're called. Okay, so so that's gone. Yes. All right, so that is off. And then same thing again for that parking light. Uh, right here. Right here. We're just gonna pull. Sorry guys, my hand's in the way, but right here. Okay, so let me just remove it for y'all. Okay guys, if you have anything that you can maybe use to pull this out without cutting them, pull them out. Okay, so we're gonna use this to pull those uh, that parking light off.
All right, so uh, there's our parking light on the right side. As you can see again, a before, I guess, video of how it looks like. And uh, simple as a plug and play. So you're gonna pull it out. Okay, and then grab your LED and just plug and play. Wait. All right, so again, we'll uh, check it. And it's good. And this is what it looks like at the after. And then, again, simple. Just push, push it in. Push the buy in, okay? At what? A gauche, a gauche, a gauche. Oh, 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 on est dans le tout, eh? Okay. Okay, push. So I think that's, that's the max. All right, so let's, let's show them what it looks like from the housing outside. That's beautiful. Wow. Show them both now. Can you get it like this? Yeah. Oh my god. That actually looks so cool. Guys, switch to LEDs. Your life will be brighter. Again, guys, same concept. Make sure to remove this plastic housing. So either counterclockwise or clockwise. Pull it out. Okay. And then we're gonna put this. So we actually have to. Okay, great. Don't do that. Okay, so that's pretty good. And then put those fasteners back on. So now, this is good enough for Megan again. It's not going anywhere. The hook is up, upwards, whatever. And now it's time to place the LED in. Actually, before we place the LED in, how about we find a good spot for the plug? Again, find a good sweet spot for it. Wow, this one's gonna be a little tough. Okay, so uh, here's our cap again with our famous big uh, hole. Uh, we got we, di we did an uh, extra thing here where we uh, drilled a bit uh, further down and that's gonna be for our wires because our wires are actually gonna stick out for the right side um, I don't know how people did it but I guess this is my way of doing it so stick your wires out of the hole first okay and then again find your sweet spot yeah, you see which side the wires are on yeah, have you? Just leave them right here. Pull. Oh. And I'll do it. move it like that. Okay, perfect. So let's test and make sure it actually works. And this one. Now you get your friend. Uh, yeah, you'll need uh, an extra pair of hands here. <laughs> As yours are both down. <laughs> well, you need the cameraman, the men doing the labor, and the men doing the talking. Yo, <laughs> buddy. I guess this is what you're, uh, what it's gonna look like after. I usually like to do tests of turning your steering all the way down. Make sure nothing is like in the way while turning. You don't wanna end up. Uh... You're gonna need a pair of these toenail clippers. <laughs> yeah. And they can't get caught in anything. What will it get caught in? Literally nothing. I do this here like that. It doesn't touch anything. What's this? Do you want to put another one? We'll put another zip tie. Just right here. Did you see this? Alright guys, so that is the final product on the left side for the high beams. And then the final product for the low beams. So as you can see, the wires stick out a bit, but it's fine. 
There is a zip tie right here. Right here. And it just keeps your stuff right in play. It doesn't move too much. And like I, I, I said, try uh, moving your steering left and right and you'll see nothing touches, nothing's in the way. And the final product is right here.